Hi guys, welcome to Nikki's Fab Life. I'm Nikki, and today's video is all about my November favorites. But before we jump in, I just wanted uh, to apologize to all my subscribers on why I've been gone. Um, I lost two very important people in my life. My grandfather <clears throat> passed away a few weeks ago, and my dog, my childhood family dog passed away, and <clears throat> It has been an extremely challenging time and I needed to take the time <clears throat> to start the healing process with my family and just take a break from posting and filming and blogging. <clears throat> if you do follow my blog, I will have that linked below. I do have two new posts. Again, the first one explaining why I'm missing and a recipe for chicken enchiladas that I made this past weekend for my husband. Um, but I am back and I plan on bringing you more videos very soon. So thanks for sticking things out with me. Um, I just needed the time to, to start healing and to start um, just taking care of myself and taking care of my family. Um, but let's get into November's favorites. I have a few things, not too, too many. And I'll start with hair products. The first one being this Gardner Fruit Teas Sleek and Shine <laughs> Sleek and Shine Flat Iron Protector. It's a straightening mist and it has argan oil in it. And it is really nice for when you're blowing out your hair or straightening it. Um, it keeps it very smooth and keeps it really straight. So I definitely recommend this. I think it's like four or five dollars at Target, Walmart, wherever you can find it, Walgreens. Um, but a really nice hairspray. The next thing that I've been really loving is my blush nude palettes by Maybelline. Um, and you can see it's, I've used it quite a bit. Um, I do have the Naked 3 palette, which I think this is comparable to. And in all honesty, I like this a lot better than the Naked 3. I don't know if it's just me or if I got a bad one, but I don't feel like the shadows stay on me very well and they don't feel buttery like some of like Naked 1 and Naked 2. Um, so I'm definitely loving this blush nudes. Again, you can find this at Ulta, Walmart, Target, any place where cosmetics are sold. Um, and I think it runs about 10 bucks. So a super great deal. And I will swatch a few of these colors for you. We'll do this gold one. And so those are those are really really pretty. Um, you can make some really pretty holiday looks with this palette. So go pick up one. <laughs> um, the next two things are both from Model Co. And it's a bronzer and a blush. The bronzer is in it's a shimmering bronzing powder. And I thought this would be really pretty for the holidays, like Thanksgiving and Christmas. Has a little bit of that sparkle to it, but not like those like really big sparkles where you could actually dig into the pan and pick them out. Um, so this is the color. I'll do a swatch of that. It's right there. And it's just really pretty. I think it's a nice uh, to warm up the face. You could contour with it. Um, I think I would use this more to warm up the face than contour just because when it has like the sparkles in it, don't think that's the best thing to use for contouring. Um, but yeah, really pretty. Again, that's by Model Co. Um, also by Model Co, I have a blush in the color Cosmopolitan. And now during the winter, I usually go for more of the mauve pinks and um, cranberry colors for blush. But I thought this baby pink was really pretty. And swatch it. And it's right there, if you can see that. And it's, again, just a really pretty color. I thought it'd be cool for the holidays, change up holiday look a little bit. So there's that by Model Co. Um, highlighting product, I've been really getting into cream highlights lately, which is weird. Usually I'm like, I hate cream products. I can never, I never feel like I can put them on correctly. Um, but I received this, I believe it was in, it was either Glossy Box or Boxy Charm, and it's by the Beauty Crop, and it's called Lighting Crew, and it has, it says it's nourished with pineapple and green tea, um, and I guess it's in the shade uh, Love You So Matcha. I 
this. It's supposed to be like, love you so much, but love you so much. Uh. Um, but it's this cute little, it has like little pineapples on it. I don't know if you can see that. I don't know, my camera's not going to focus on it. But I'll insert a picture, and it's just pretty. Um, let's do a little swatch of it. And again, it's just like a really pretty highlight, and I think it'd be great for the holidays. I'm all about figuring out makeup for the holidays, what's going to look good. Um, next three things I have are lip products, and the first one, I went Black Friday shopping, so I guess this is a newer favorite. It's not necessarily for the whole month of November, but Tarte had this collection of like four miniature size lipsticks. And this is in Sangria, and I am in love with this shade. I know I'm definitely going to have to go buy it in the normal size because it is beautiful. And I think it's going to look great for Christmas. Um, I just think it's a great winter color. And if you've never used Tarte products before, their lipstick smell minty, which I love. I think that's great. So definitely um, go pick up the holiday set. I think it's like four or five of like their mini lipsticks. For $21 and Sephora has it that's where I got mine so go pick one up um, the next lip product I like is this Spi spicy mauve and this is a L'Oreal color and it's actually what I have on my lips today but I will still swatch it it's right there um, and I think this is just a real again a really pretty color I do like the darker vampy colors but sometimes I feel like those are hard to wear especially to work and I feel like both of these colors are really work friendly um, the next color I have is this Wet n Wild Fergie lipstick, and it's in Cabernet. And I thought this was really pretty. Again, it is a darker vampy color, so you might have a hard time wearing it to work or whatever, but I think it's beautiful. Um, I wore it the other day to go grocery shopping. I put mascara and I put this lipstick on, and I was ready to go. I look, you know, not made up, but enough that I felt comfortable enough to go out. So again, that's a really pretty color. Um, Walgreens has, ha has had the Fergie line. I know I have a hard time finding it. I know like Target sells uh, Wet n Wild, but they don't always have all the Fergie stuff. So Walgreens had gift Fergie Wet n Wild gift sets and then other Wet n Wild gift sets and then all these Fergie lipsticks. So definitely go pick one of those up. That is all the beauty favorites I have for the month. Let's get into some other favorites. So my next favorite is this Holiday Trio Candle by Yankee Candle, and it has Holiday Cinnamon, Snowberry, and Home for Christmas in it, and it just smells like everything you want Christmas to smell like. I like that it had the three different scents in it. I'm definitely going to have to go pick up more of these. I think uh, I'm going to go through this one pretty quickly. I've been burning through candles like crazy. Um, I don't know, candles have been soothing me, so at night I'm light, I light like three or four. Um, one of my breakfast bar, one next to the couch, one in front of the TV, and it just relaxes me. So um, I'm definitely going to go pick up a few more of these. They did have some other scents, so I'm excited to see what else they have. Um, but yeah, this is a great candle. I definitely recommend picking it up. Um, I have two books that I wanted to talk to you about, and the first one is... The Life-Changing Magic of Tidying Up. Um, and it's the Japanese art of decluttering and organizing. And if you're anything like me, you might be a collector of stuff. Um, maybe junk, maybe books, maybe makeup. Um, I tend to collect makeup books and purses. That's Those are just my things that I really love. Um, and as we go into the holiday season, season, season if I can talk, um, it's not that I appreciate what I have any more than I usually do. I just, I feel like I've made aware of the things I own more than any other time of the year because I'll be giving and because I'll be get, receiving gifts. Um, so this year I wanted to donate a bunch of my stuff and I'll show you over there I have three full bags of purses, clothing, makeup, different things that I'm going to be donating. Um, to local charities in the area um, just because I have too much and I want to give back and I am so fortunate to be able when I want to go buy a lipstick I can go buy a lipstick or if I want a new shirt or a new pair of pants or a purse 
I'm usually able to do that. Um, so I did want to give back, but also in my giving back, I wanted my goal for 2016 is to get more organized and to only have the things that I need and only have the things that give me love and give me pleasure. So this book was a really good read. It really helped me figure out how to decide what I'm keeping and what I'm giving away. Um, and it's sort of like you pick some, you first off, you take everything of what you're sorting and you put it in a pile. So for example, you take all your purses, you put them in the pile and you hold each one and you say, does this give me joy? Or is this something that I would repurchase again? If it does, you know it's something that you should keep. If not, it has served its purpose in your life and it's time to move on um, and give it away, pass it on. Um, another thing with this book is it says that you usually, when you're trying to get rid of things, you want to give them to family members or um, people that you know, like you're pushing off your things on other people because it's so hard to th throw it away. Um, and I do agree that it's, it is hard to throw things away. I am going to stop pushing makeup and purses and things on my family members when they don't want them. So that is why I am donating the three bags I have over here. So definitely go pick this up. Um, I got my copy at Target and it was 30% off when I got it and I believe that is still going on. So um, I would definitely recommend keeping uh, going and getting a copy of this and I've read it twice now. Um, and every time I go to clean something out, I end up getting rid of a ton more because I just realized that thing, the things I have, I love, but some of them have already served their purpose and it's time to move them on to their next destination. So that's it for that book. Um, the next thing I want to talk to you about is, um, Mindy Kaling's new book. Why not me? It's been out for a little while. I've already read it twice. I really love Mindy. I feel like in real life uh, we would be good friends if if she was just a normal person, but she's not. She's a fabulous celebrity. Um, but I love everything that she does. I read her other book and it's just a really great funny read. So if you're looking for something to read over the holidays that you just want to relax and not have to read you know, schoolwork or serious books, pick up a copy of her book. Again, I got her book at Target and it was 30% off. So definitely recommend that. And last but not least is sort of a big purchase for me because I usually would not spend money on something like this considering I tend to pick up a few of them a year and I ordered myself an Erin Condren planner. I am the type of girl that will buy two or three planners in one year span because I think, oh, that one's cute. I, I need to have that. Um, my old planner sucks or it, it broke or pages are torn, but I got this beautiful Erin Condren planner and it, you know, has the nice um, spiral binding and I got pineapples and I got it personalized. So that's great. Um, but it has really been great. I have some pictures and stuff posted in here. Um, but it is really helping me keep organized on my weight loss journey. Um, it's keeping me organized with other, you know, things, work and school. Um, so I believe once shipping, once I paid for shipping and taxes, I believe I ended up paying like 55 bucks for it. But it was a really, really great deal. Um, and I'm not mad that I did it. It is heavy duty and the covers are interchangeable. So if I get sick of the pineapples, I can go online and order a new cover for it. Um, so I'm very excited about my Erin Condren planner. I think it's um, going to be a great addition in helping me stay organized with my whole, you know, tidying up um, journey mission. So definitely excited about the planner. I will have a referral link below if you're interested in your own planner. Um, go ahead, click, click that and you'll get $10 off your first order. Uh, so go check out her, the Erin Condren website. There are tons and tons and tons of planners. Um, planners, notebooks, uh, stationery cards. She has a bunch of really great stuff and she actually just came out with a wedding planner. Um, and I'm already married so I don't need that but I do know this is engagement season so if you do get engaged go on over and get yourself one of those great Erin Condren, Condren planners. Um, two more things I want to mention before I leave. I just joined Ebates and I'm super excited about that. This is not a sponsored video. This is just me coming to you on my own, um, letting you know. And 
I've been doing some Christmas shopping online and I've already earned back like $20 just from going through their website and purchasing things. So I definitely recommend um, you going to their site, signing up, and anytime you do online shopping, click their link and get your cash back. Um, so I'll have a link for that below. And last but not least, I have started selling Avon. Um, so I will have my Avon site below. And you can shop all the open catalogs, um, all of the products they have online. And Avon is really great. We all know they have beauty products and fashion, but they also have really great home products. Um, this candle, for example, this is a Coastal Waters candle from Avon, and it, they remind me of the Bath & Body Works candles. They're the three wick candles, um, same size, and right now they are running for, on for uh, two for 20 on the Avon website. So again, it would be a really great Christmas gift, and I think if and you have until the end of this week or next week, if you order, um, you'll receive your product in time for Christmas. So definitely go check out those links below. Um, and that's it guys. Thanks so much for watching and I will see you next time. In the meantime though, remember to hashtag stay fabulous. Bye guys.